Three days back, Mr. Rao got his son for a routine eye checkup. He was complaining about how his son was squinting his eyes and was holding his book really close to his face. His son's school teacher had complained to him, telling him that his son was really struggling to see the board despite wearing glasses. But the catch here was, he had just changed his glasses three months back. As an eye surgeon, I really listened to his questions and his queries and then asked him a simple question, does his son rub his eyes? To which his answer was yes. And he also said that he thought it was a natural allergy process that everybody undergoes and uh, it ends up after a point of time. That these symptoms fade over, over a period of time. But I told him that these signs, including persistent eye rubbing, frequent change in spectacles, uh, photosensitivity towards light, and also preference to sit in the front uh, branch in the school, all these could point towards a condition called as keratoconus, a progressive condition wherein the front part of the eye bulges out, causing impairment in the vision. Keratoconus is an inflammatory ectatic condition characterized by steepening and also the thinning of the cornea. For a moment, Mr. Rao panicked and looked visibly concerned. I told him I and I also reassured him that keratoconus is a treatable condition. Sooner the detection, sooner the intervention, better the vision. I explained to him that there are different management modalities in treating keratoconus. Firstly, the medical management. Here, what we do is we use topical medications to prevent or to halt the progression of keratoconus. Secondly, the surgical management. Here, we have option of topographic guided PRK with cross-linking to prevent the progression. And we also have the intracorneal ring segment with cross-linking to treat the keratoconus. Mr. Rao then looked relieved and said, I wish I had known these signs earlier. So what I would want to bring to everybody's notice is if your child is having difficulty focusing, if your child's spectacles keep changing and if you at all, if your child is having severe eye rubbing, it's time that you visit an ophthalmologist. Early detection and timely intervention are the key in treating keratoconus. As I left with a clear plan, I thought to myself, a little awareness goes a long way in preserving something as precious as vision. Thank you.